quite magnificent. From the Tenke Fungurumu mine in the Katanga, we have a matrix of a young dolomite. And then perched on top of that is this lawn of, I'm not sure, I think we're looking at cobalton calcite crystals, tiny cobalton calcite crystals, which uh, have been coated by perhaps some malachite or colwezite, this, this off green, it's actually a very strange green, not typical of malachite, sort of a bayildenite green. And then uh, this again has been all coated with druzy quartz crystals. Now, let, let me just show you this section. There's some pinkishness there. So this would be most likely a thin layer of cobalt and calcite. And also, um, there's some black material, uh, which would be heterogenite, little waxy black bottoids of heterogenite. From a display point of view, it would stand flat like this on a turntable. Size-wise, we're looking at a hand size. So it's a pretty large piece. So this would be your effect, and then looking from the top down, you'd have this effect. Lovely uh, little botroids of the uh, a very bling-bling material. Let me just see if we can get in a little bit closer. Better look. It's a lovely green, a strange green, not a typical malachite green, uh, by yieldonite green. Well, I don't know in color terms. Um, I'm not all that good with colors, but definitely not typical malachite green. Lawn of this druzy quartz over these botroids underneath. All the way from the Tenke Fungurumu mine in the Katanga. Lovely piece. And these openings here would be a little uh, heterogenite botroids popping out there. I think if you zoom into the still pictures, you'll be able to see them. Let's just see if we can zoom in there. Little botroids of heterogenite in those open sections.